What's going on everybody, my name is Hydrus and welcome back to some more Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle and today we are up to some more shenanigans because as you guys saw in the previous video we gave guaranteed additional super attacks to Gogeta Blue's passive and here today for Tech LR Vegito Blue we have given him counters into his passive so today we're going to see what that is like against the Legends Fight Goku event and if you guys do want to use this patch for yourselves links to it will be down in the description down below but before we do, we'll go ahead and get started today. Make sure you guys do subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Click that bell to turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any future videos, especially ones like these where we have some fun and add some interesting things to characters that they don't already have. So again, we are running the Last Resort team. I am running Vegito as the leader, so we have a friend as well. And we too have the Supreme Kai of Time on our team and Cooler for those, those beautiful mwah, supports on our team. And I actually want my unit to be fun. I just want my unit to to be the first attacking unit here just gonna give all these greens but yes once Vegito does transform into good into Vegito blue he will gain counters to his passive attack and that is uh that's just gonna be freaking insane because he's already really good and Gogeta getting the guaranteed additional super if you guys do want to check that video out links to it be down in the description down below but if you but Gogeta with the additional super guaranteed like Vegeta Blue gets, he was he was already insane as is. And he and Gogeta broke even more. So <laughs> I think Vegito Blue gaining the counters to his passive are just gonna absolutely destroy the game completely. I think we're just gonna break everything today with <laughs> this passive update for uh Vegito Blue here, but I don't know. Do you guys think so far, before we do see anything with the passive, do you think it's going to be really OP? Let me know down in the comments down below. Or do you think it's just going to kind of be average like all the rest of them? It does still, uh, counters are still immense power. I believe every single Vegito that has counters uh, does get uh, immense power regardless. And they do have damage reduction, which I did take damage reduction off because I didn't think it was relatively necessary. I mean, it's an LR. I mean, he's not... He's not too bad at defense once he does get a super attack off. So, I did take the the reduced damage on normal attacks off of the counter, so that's not there anymore, but it, it's just tremendous power like always. It's still a normal counter attack, but the only thing it doesn't do is uh, re damage reduction on normal attacks and stuff like that. So, that's going to that's gonna be interesting to see how that plays out. I just didn't think the damage reduction was necessary, so I did take it off, but that, that's, that's, again... I don't think it will ultimately matter. I think it will just destroy the game regardless here. And it's going to be an incredible, incredible time seeing Vegito get some uh, some of these counters off. I don't even I don't even know. I want to see him get a counter with Supreme Kai of Time on, uh, on the rotation. That would be pretty cool to see how well the counter performs with her, as well as Cooler. I think uh, they, I think he will transform next turn. Oh no, the, the Vegito, the next Vegito, the Vegito that I put on the next rotation that I floated off will in fact get his counters once he does transform next turn, so he will transform. Because this is turn three, yes, yes, this is turn three. But yeah, he'll he'll get his counters next turn. I think Vegito here will knock out uh, this Goku and will be done before we do transform. Woo! Again, Vegito is an already good oh, oh goodness. Goku did not did not expect that at all. <laughs> Yes, there we go. Transform. Vegito Blue! Ah, I love the uh, the voice animations. Oh, I love that I added these to these units because it makes them so much cooler to use. If you do want to check out the voice animation, the voice additions to the transformations uh, patch for Unidokan, you can check that out in the description down below. I did do a video on that as well as where you can find the download link for that because that's... I love the I love that patch that I created for the voices. Um, it just makes it so much makes it so much more unique, I guess. I don't know, but it is what it is. But here we go. We're gonna see this counter pop off here on that normal attack. Counters. Ooh, okay, okay, not too bad. But I think once we get up there, once we start, you know, getting more more towards uh, MUI, that he he will indeed. Of be getting some nice hefty hefty counter attacks off against these guys. Ooh, a third additional. Yes, Vegito. Give me some more. 
Ooh, counter to one million. <laughs> one million on a normal. Tell me on this attack stat. 1.1. <laughs> Uh, Gogeta's gonna finish it off. That's okay if Gogeta does, though. I don't mind. Next turn, our other Vegeta will, uh, will also be... I'll try and put them on slots where they're gonna get attacked more, at least that Vegito. And there is his transformation. Vegeta Blue! Oh, goodness, I love it. I love it so much. Okay, so we do have Opai Pai of time, and... He's gonna get hit two times. The last spot would be ideal, but that's okay. So we are, we're just gonna get him get hit those two times up in the front. And these are gonna be super effective attacks too against uh, this Goku. Ooh, he's gonna counter him to bits, man. All right, let's see what you can do. <laughs> 2.2 million on a counter? Are we serious? That was a crit though, but still, and type effectiveness, but oh my lord. Oh, he's gonna finish it here. <laughs> that was so stupid. 2.2 .2 million on a counter. Oh man. And this is my Vegeta. This wasn't the friend one. I mean, I mean, technically using Trident. If you do want to check out Trident, by the way, which gives you access to all the units in the game, um, as much as you have unique units, bro. But if you do want to check out Trident, link to Trident will be down in the description down below. If you do want to try it out for yourself and try out some of the units that you may not have. And also, ooh, we're gonna get countered. Ooh, uh, that's. That's a beautiful, beautiful attacking slot for him, I just noticed. But yeah, if you do want to check out Trident, links to the Discord. Link to the Unidokon Discord as well. If you want to check out some more patches by other creators and stuff like that, link to the Unidokon Discord. I highly, 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 highly recommend you guys check out the, woo, the Unidokon Discord as well as the Trident Discord if you're having trouble with Trident or a Unidokon patch or the APK or patcher itself. Woo! 2.2! 5.7? Oh my goodness, man. This is, this is insane! But yeah, I recommend joining the Discords because there's a great support in there if you do have trouble. So make sure you guys do join the Unidokon Discord if you're using patches, as well as if you need help with Trident. The Trident Discord is a great place to be. And I always advocate for you guys to join them because that is the greatest place to get the support for any troubles that you may have. And that, and that middle spot is looking beautiful for him. So I'm gonna grab that orb here. I'm gonna grab those greens. Then I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna just grab those, that's okay. Boy, I can't wait to see this counter. Please don't take him out, Fujito. Please let the let the LR shine today. I mean, you're not going to do much, I guess. The counters is what I'm expecting right now. Just, just to see all the counters just destroy him. Oh my goodness. What are you guys thinking about these counters, though? Do you think LR Fujito Blue, the tech one, the tech LR Fujito Blue, do you think he will be extremely OP? Bias, what you're seeing in this video, do you think he's OP with counters, or do you think they should have just given him counters because, you know, for the heck of it, why not, right? Why why not give him those counters? Uh, to me, personally, I think he would be a little too broken with counters, so I, I understand and respect the decision not to give him the counter attacks because the super uh, additional that he always gets, as well as just everything else with these cards, especially Gogeta, even though Gogeta doesn't get counters he still has the super effective against all types that is still insane two million not even a crit but again that's still type effective but still two million damage oh my goodness boys all right now we're going against goku and let's see oh pie pie of time is gonna just oh we're getting those greens i didn't realize okay we're gonna get these reds for good gogeta and there we go oh, we're at one million attack stat just just by oh let's see what you do one million Mm, oh, well, that's not a crit. That's okay. Let's see if we can get a crit, Vegito. Ooh, not a crit yet. Can we get one? Ooh, okay. Oh, I'm not dodging that. Ooh, is that six million? Ooh, Vegito, calm down, son. Ooh, my goodness. Yeah, Vegito with counters on top of his unit already. I didn't change anything to Vegito. All I did was simply give him counters i added it to the passive that already existed so he keeps his original passive as well as gaining counters this man is broken and it is stupid insane because i don't think any unit that released after this if they did give him counters i don't think oh yeah this is the guaranteed additional i do have the guaranteed additional super for gogeta in the same patch as the counter for vegeta so you do get both the best of both worlds of those patches by the way so just an fyi 
but <laughs> I think he would be stupid, stupid busted, and no unit in the world would ever beat him unless they release something even worse busted than good Vegito. Because <laughs> it just doesn't, it just won't happen. You know, just for this, I know we're going to do counters, but I just want to get this active skill off. Just let's do it. Final Kamehameha! Yeah, boy! Boom! Crit! Ah, oh, no crit, but we did finish him, that's good. Woo! That KO screen, my man, that KO screen. But yeah, uh, like I was saying, I think... <laughs> oh my god, we're gonna get a lot of counters in that first slot. I need to heal also, but, um... Yeah, giving him counters, I think, would... He's already... Probably, him and Gogeta are the top tier units in the game right now. Better than Kalen Khalifa, in my opinion. Uh, take that at, at, with a grain of salt, if you will. But, again, I do think that, you know, they're the top tier units. And if they happened to give Vegito counters on top of what he has already, not only because he gets the guaranteed super, he's already better than Gogeta in some regards, but Gogeta still has that super effective against all types, so it's kind of like, it's kind of like the trade-off with the guaranteed super and then he gets the super effective typing, right? But if he, as he is now, and then added a counter, there's no doubt in my mind, yes, Vegeta would have been way, way, way better than Gogeta, and Vegeta would be stupid busted. And this is all just for fun, by the way. I'm just showing off these units with counters and whatnot just to you know show you guys hey this is what could have been this is how broken all of this would have been as well and you know it's just all in good fun but again if you do want to try this out for yourself you can always check out the unidokon patch and stuff like that i always link it in the description down below for you guys but yeah it's it, it, fajito is just crazy busted yes i'm glad i popped a Whis here because i'd have been dead if i hadn't oh my goodness <sighs> Oh, that's with a Wii active tool. That's still super effective. Ooh, that counter. Bam. Ooh, crit. Yes. 4.9. All right, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I do still have uh, the Bulma item as well. As well. I could in increase his attack a bit. Don't dodge. Yeah, don't dodge. Don't dodge. Can I get a crit, please? Nah, no crit. Really? Goodness. We are going to take some damage. We're going to take some normals here. He's going to take some counters. Ooh. Come on, give me a crit. Give me a crit. Yeah, the two million crit. One more. Ah, no crit. But Gogeta with that super effective about to come through right now. Watch. Just watch the super effective come through. Crit. Nah, no crit. Yeah, that, this event specifically, if you didn't have Gogeta, Vegito, unless he got crits, and if you, I have crit equips on him too. But unless you got crits, God UI tanks him. And if it wasn't for the counters, MUI would be taking a little bit longer than he is right now. Because again, I do have the counters helping me out with a lot of this. <laughs> Ooh, we're getting the additional with you too. All right, we have next turn, we have the Vegito as well. My Vegito that I think is stacked up a little bit more than this one was. So, ooh. I think I'll have active on him next turn or did I use my active already? Did I use mine? Yeah, I did use mine, so that's fine. But, ooh, all these beauty counters that we're about to get, especially with Opai Pai of Time on our team here today. Ooh. Also, if you guys are enjoying the video, make sure to smack that like button down below. Let's see if we can get 100 likes on today's video for the beautiful, beautiful crits. If we get a crit here. Ah, but uh, get some. Uh, let's get a hundred likes to this video for the counter attack on Vegito. If you guys are enjoying it and you you know kind of like seeing the what if kind of videos and stuff, definitely have more planned if you want to see some more in the future. And we're at what six point three million, or is that? Yeah, that's six point three million on this right here, and he's not dodging it. So can we get a crit on the Dokon attack? Vegito, my boy, 7.1 million damage. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> All right, so final thoughts on this. I've kind of mentioned this already, but final thoughts on this. Again, this is super fun. It's super interesting and really fun to use Vegito with counters on his unit. 
If they had given him counters, there's no doubt in my mind Vegeta would have been the way better of the two to go for. As they are currently without count, you know, as they are normally in the game, Vegito gets a little bit of edge on Gogeta because of that guaranteed additional. But again, Gogeta also has that super effective against all types, so that's interesting to see. Kind of, they kind of counterbalance it just a little bit, but Vegito is slightly better in that regard. But if they did give Vegito counters, my lord, Vegito would have been way, way, way better than Gogeta in a long shot because he would be countering. And at some points, again, it was super effective against him, but we did get like 2 million crit and 2 million damage on a counter attack with him. And that was freaking insane. Imagine if it was Gogeta getting a counter and hitting it against uh, and hitting it against UI with that super effective type and stuff like that. That would be insane by itself. But if you guys did enjoy the video, like I said, let's see if we can smack out 100 likes. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Click that bell to turn on notifications. Go ahead and check out the Gogeta guaranteed additional super video that I did. It was really fun to do that one as well. And, and these two kind of go hand in hand. If you want to check out the patch, the patch for the the guaranteed additional super on Gogeta as well as the counter attacks on Vegito. It is all in one patch down in the description down below if you want to download it for Unidokon. As well as check out Unidokon and Trident's Discord. Again, check out all that stuff down in the description down below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a fantastic day.